Thank you for Patreon now for donating to the Patreon. Hey guys, it's Vadiazzo, so back in another Pokemon Legends Arceus video. So I hope you guys enjoyed them, like, comment, subscribe, and subscribe, shall we? Before we do anything, I just want to say, yes! Fucking, yeah, you have no idea what I just had to go through. So, um, first up, as you can see by the title, we're going to do the Spirit Tomb today, because, guess what? That is the final Pokemon I have on my list to catch before we can catch Arceus. Long story short, here's what happened. I finished every single Pokemon Dex entry on... Sunday or Saturday. Well, after we caught the legendary, so technically it was Monday. But everything but the legendaries I have finished on Saturday or Sunday, like either basically January 1st or December 31st. And right now it's January 4th on Wednesday. Be and the reason why I didn't finish all of them is because, wh where is it? Because there were four specific Pokemon that were a pain in the ass to get. First up, there's these two. These two aren't that bad because their base forms can be found in, um, di what, what's it called? The, the dimension shifters and, um, you know, the two areas uh, uh, in Mount Cornet. So their base forms aren't that bad, except I didn't know that when I was trying to find them the first time, so that was fair. And then there was Munchlax. Munchlax is a pain in the ass because this motherfucker has like a 3 to 8% chance of spawning in two different areas. Uh, Alabaster Iceland's the snowfall area and then this area, the Heights Camp. Thankfully, I got lucky today. Like, I. Because I had tried all day yesterday and he didn't show up fucking once. And the second I came to here, like 10 minutes before I started recording this, I came over here to the Heights Camp. There were two of them right next to each other in front of the camp. And I was like, fuck! Yes, 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 can't fuck this up. And then Bonsley. Bonsley only spawns in two places. One of them is based on random luck. That's the Cornet Highlands. And then the other one you have to fucking find him in the crimson Myerlands, but only one will spawn and i sat there for literally 20 minutes going back and forth between the jubilee village and the diamond settlement to find this guy because he spawns nearby and i finally found the asshole and then cherubi cherubi essentially i just cheated because i saved the game before i left I also turned off autosave which i should turn back on now and essentially what i did is i just kept uh, going to mount cornet breaking all the trees until eventually a cherubi popped up and it did so cool um let's quickly turn autosave back on because I am not doing any of that again. That was pure hell. So cool. We're not, we're good now, and I didn't save it, did I? It, oh, it is on save. Okay, cool. Uh, anyways, saving the game, and let's go get the spirit tomb. So I have a website pulled up that I'm gonna pull from this for each wisp. Um, I'm starting here, even though I should be starting in Jubilee Village, but whatever. So uh, I'll put the website in the link in the description. So let's go.
And that, ladies and gentlemen, is all of the wisps. I have no idea how I'm going to edit this. All I'm gonna say is this. That was pure hell. So, um, whoo. Now we can go finally catch Spirit Tomb, but before we do that, we must talk to Vessa. Please don't tell me I went the wrong way. Great God, you have no, I mean, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, but let's just say this, there's a lot of editing in my future for that video, but um, all we had, especially because the Alabaster Icelands and the Obsidian Minefields camera glitch, but thankfully the other ones didn't. Anyways, 100, oh yeah, she also gives you rewards for each one. I wrote them down, so let's go ahead. Uh, 90 Wisp gives you two Experience Candies XLs as I pull up my phone because I wrote them down in my notes. You gathered 100 Wisps, take this as well, which is three Grit Rocks. And now you've gathered all the, uh, wow, you've gathered every last one of the wisps. I really can't thank you enough. <sighs> now we can finally seal that havoc wreaking bundle of mischief once more. But we'll need to go to the Shrouded Ruins. That's the only place the sealing will work. We should meet there at the same time of day when it's, as we first met. Hope you remember. So I think that means you have to head to the Shrouded Ruins at night time, but yeah. Okay, so, yeah, okay, thank God it says at night. Okay, so this is our last step before we can catch Arceus. So here's the rewards you get for, um, getting all the whips. If you collect five or more, she'll give you an oval stone. If you collect 10 or more, she'll give you a um, rare candy. If you collect 20 or more, she'll give you one seed of mastery. If you collect 30 or more, she'll give you a dust stone. 40 or more will give you an experience candy large. 50 or more will give you a linking cord. 60 or more will give you five grit pebbles. 70 or more will give you scrap metal or like a scrap of reaper cloth. And then 80 or more will give you three seeds of mastery. And then the last two we just saw. So, um, we have to wait till nighttime for this. I don't know if it auto flagged it or not. I don't know what the flag was for. Probably from when I was trying to find all the wisps. I tell you what, that genuinely does take like a long time. I mean, granted, it only took me an hour and I was going back and forth between all of my devices because one of them wouldn't work for loading the link. One of them would. Um, I have no idea where I'm supposed to meet her at. Um, I'm just gonna take a shot in the dark and say it's where the flag is. Even though something tells me it's not that at all, and I'm gonna pull this up on my phone just in case I'm wrong. Then again, it might be dead center, so I might be heading there anyways, but uh, let's just quickly go over here, make sure it's not in the center anywhere. Yeah, I don't see her, so it's probably this way. I hope it's this. We'll stop when we see a giant spirit tomb thing. That's when we know we're going the right way, when we see a giant spirit tomb thing. Okay, so this is the wrong way. Maybe, I don't know. So this is why I kept my phone on me. Okay, does the phone still have it pulled up? Thank God it does. Okay, going all the way to the bottom of the list. Give me a five seconds to figure this out. Um, oh God, that is some weird glitches happening on there. Um, oh, now it won't let me go beyond the freaking list. Okay, there we go. No, thing, stop, 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 stop. Oh my God, phone, stop. I just need like five seconds to read this. Oh my God, the loading is being hell. Oh my God. Okay. Shrouded runes, right? I forgot about that. The shrouded runes. That's what. Okay, I didn't know the thing was gonna chase me. Okay, shrouded rune, shrouded rune, shrouded rune, shrouded runes. Why didn't I just head to the diamond camp? I'm an idiot. Ow, dick. Okay, where is? The well, at least now I know what it looks like when my camera glitches. Because for once, I actually got to see it glitch. I must say, it looks really weird. But let's go ahead, run all the way to the shrouded runes. Hopefully, we make it there in time as I prepare my ultra balls. Because I also know our after this, I I'm pretty sure like. The current plan is this, right after I catch this thing, I'm gonna go catch Arceus. Like, I am not perfectly prepared, but I'm prepared enough. Especially because I've been waiting like a week to do this, and I was literally, the only reason why I didn't do it is because freaking Munchlax and a goddamn Cherubi were annoying. I'll explain in the Arceus video, but um, yeah, so up here, where is she? Is she towards the center? Where is she specific? I'm just gonna bravery this, because she said shrouded runes. So where is she? That's, oh, there it is. Okay, here we go. Braveheart. Ow. Yep, the cutscene ensues. Hazel, I'm glad you came. Let's get started, shall we? Should've saved the game. First of all, a confession. I may have told you one teeny tiny lie about the wisp. There are actually 108 of them. Why 108 though? I've been holding on to the last one. Could you put in the odd keystone with the others? Okay, why didn't you tell us about the 108th one before? But wait, before that, well, Ezel, what do you think of me? You're strange, that's for sure, but that's the most I got. 
A strange one, huh? Yeah, you're right. We really do understand me. I'm sorry, what? Here it goes. The final wisp. After this, the traveler who tri who used a strange magic will finally forgive me. Right? Ah, close your eyes for a sec, would you? I'm sorry, Volo? Was she hinting to Volo? No, 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 rewind the clock, rewind the clock. Don't tell me she was Spirit Tomb. Or her herself was a wisp. I'm just gonna... Cause I know what happens after the- Don't tell me she was a fucking wisp the whole time. Or like she was spirit tomb. I'm curious now- There are a lot of questions I have now, mainly about the Traveler. If it was Vol or not. The odd keystone is glowing. Disappeared without a trace. Oh great, more ghost stories. Making you gather all those wisps was my last bit of mischief. Thanks for playing along. Please, don't forget about me. Okay, so that was- So she was spirit tomb. That's- right? That's what that is? Also, yeah, such a strange of a strange poke. Um, where is it? Oh, there it is. Um, I should not send out regis to this. Get your ass over here, bitch. <laughs> okay, so, I did say before this, like I did, um, uh, hopefully nothing I do kills it. Something tells me that's doubtful. Please don't kill. Ah, uh, you had to put it that high of damage. God damn it, Sarah. Uh, Ultra Ball? Maybe from this health? Please work? Please? I beg of you? So I can save as many as I can for, um, not Palky or Dialga Arceus? That's not gonna catch, is it? Oh, it does! Oh, wow, that worked out perfectly, actually. Thanks, game. <laughs> Hell yeah. So, that marks the end of this episode, and next time, um,. We're gonna do the final episode, which is taking on Arceus, believe it or not. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, join the Discord, follow Twitch, and I'll see you all in the next one when we take on the Pokemon God. Don't forget to check us out.